Atlanta Journal 500 was marred by the first Winston Cup fatality in five years. Grant Adcox was competing in his third Winston Cup race this year. On the 198th lap, his car suddenly darted to the right, hitting the wall with great force. A small oil fire quickly extinguished itself. It took rescue workers nearly 12 minutes working with the jaws of life to peel the roof off the car and get Grant out. After treatment at the Enfield Medical Center, he was airlifted to Georgia Baptist Hospital in Atlanta, where he was pronounced dead of head and chest injuries. Driving for his father, Herb, with whom he owned a car dealership, Adcox gained most of his racing fame in ARCA. He was king of the super speedways with eight victories, including five at Talladega and two at Atlanta. He had planned to continue his career, which began in 1968 in the NASCAR Grand National Division. Grant Adcox was 39.